blowed. Don't ever, don't ever tell me I have a weak blow. <laughs> Today, I thought it would be very fun if we did the quizzing Matt on different feminine products to see if he knows what they are. And I'm actually very, very excited to see how well he does. <laughs> I actually think that he's gonna do decently well. I'm gonna be sort of disappointed. I don't know what to expect, but let's just do this. <laughs> okay, so. Don't look. We'll start out kind of easy. What is this? <laughs> That's a tampon. <laughs> so you really meant feminine. I don't know if you were talking about like hair products and everything. It's really. It's. In wow. The, it's not gonna be all like hair products though. Okay. Okay. What's this? A maxi pad. Yes. <laughs> Two for two, guys. This is gonna be easy. She thought she was gonna get me, really. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna ask you a question. Okay. Okay, so. This is gonna be a really uncomfortable question. I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> so, if I was gonna tell you or ask you what is wings versus no wings, what would you say? Mm, it has to do with tampons, if they have like a little thing on it. With tampons? On the sides. No, wait, with the pads. <laughs> Well, it has a little thing on the side. That does what? Uh, I don't want to say. <laughs> <laughs> I think it helps it stay in place, right? The, the pad? The wings helps it stay attached there. To what? I don't know, your nether regions? It doesn't stick to our nether regions. <laughs> what would you set it on? <laughs> I don't know. Your underwear. Oh, really? Oh, really? So the flaps are off. like, it goes on the underwear to hold it oh. in place and the underwear not stuck to me. <laughs> I see. <laughs> Close, good. Whoever thought of that is really uh, innovative. Okay, next question. If I asked you, what is the difference between a pad and a liner? Why are you doing this to me? <laughs> You said they weren't all period related. They aren't. These initial ones are, but... Oh, man. I feel like I'm getting the hardest ones first, then. <laughs> a liner sounds like it would just line the inside of your uh, panties. <laughs> Ew, I hate that word. <laughs> I don't like panties. Or, yeah, that's my answer. That's that, that works, yeah. It's like a lining, so it just goes on on your light days, and you use a pad on the heavy days. Or you use a liner when you have a tampon in, so it it just catches the little droplets that don't get absorbed. This is really an educational uh, <laughs> video for our 20% of male viewers out there, according to YouTube analytics. <laughs> okay, ready? Yes. This one we're leaving the pad realm and female menstrual cycles realm. Okay, what's this? That's that thing that you put in your hair to like wrap your hair around it to make a little bun. Yes. See, I said it. You're gonna get these. It's gonna be boring because you're not gonna say anything. <laughs> Big brain season, huh? Come on, guys. It's too easy. Okay, I think this one might stump you. What's this? That's a thing that goes on the back of like your straps to make them do a little pat. What the heck? Get out of here! <laughs> not you guys. <laughs> Oh, you're annoying. Okay. Here's this. I feel like you're gonna get this one. What are these? They cover up your nipples so you can't see them through your shirt. <laughs> yeah. They're called pasties. Come on, give me some. Give me some hard <laughs> ones. Today. Give me some hard. I'm ones. trying. Okay. Ah. I feel like you might get this one too. Okay. What is this? Oh. So you got me here. <laughs> It's like a plunger. <laughs> Is this one? Um... <laughs> I 
<laughs> I honestly it's have, not a plunger, I will tell you that. I honestly have no idea. I could formulate a guess, but I don't want to. I just want to say my sister's sitting here, so she's just kind of watching that. <laughs> um, it, Is it like vaginally related? It is vaginally related. That's what I was thinking. It looks like you would like squeeze it and then I don't, I don't even want to. No, it looks like it goes up in there and collects like period blood or something. That's correct. Are you serious? It's a menstrual cup. So if you don't want to use, if your type of person doesn't want to use pads and tampons, you want to save your money, you just buy a menstrual cup and you clean it. You threw me off there because I thought the period was <laughs> You came back to it. I'm sensing a theme here. Okay, ready? Yes. What is this? It's like some sort of medieval torture device. Is that, uh, oh gosh. Does that like do your eyelashes? <laughs> like. <laughs> no. Oh Lord. I don't know then. You want to tell you? Yes, please. <laughs> It's when you go to get checked, it's what your doctors use to like clamp open your vagina. No. To check you, yes. So it has nothing to do with your eyelash. Does that hurt? I don't know, I've never had it done. I've honestly never gone to go get checked. Uh, which I probably should, but. That's kind of painful. <laughs> Eyelashes. Some of these things you ladies do to your bodies is barbaric, I swear. Uh, okay. What is this? Is that like, if you're in public and you really gotta go, you gotta like pee into a cup slyly so you just slide it? <laughs> Does it help a woman pee like a man? Like yes. standing up? Yeah. It's called a shiwi. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I'm like 9 for 10 right now. It's not fair. I knew you'd get them. She doesn't realize how smart I am. I'll say I did realize that's Mario. I said I thought so what is, the, what is the what is the she we used for? Is it like so you're you going? Can pee, stand, like you travel. Like I hate like sitting on toilets when I travel. So there's people who are like mm. they don't like toilets and stuff, and they're like it's gross. So you can just pee standing up. That's amazing. I should probably get one. Shoot, I hate yeah. toilets. I wonder if you get those like in the future surgically attached, and it's just always right there. Ew. <laughs> what? Nobody wants that. Never mind. I can think of at least three issues with that. <laughs> Ready for the next one? Yes. Okay. What is this? That is... Is that like... That looks like the gel you'd rub on a pregnant woman's stomach. Is that her final answer? I don't want it to be. Do you rub, is that, I can't even tell if that's like lotion or water, or what is that? <laughs> what is going on here? I'm not giving you hints. Is that a bar of soap? What is that? <laughs> Are you done? I'm gonna say it's like something you rub on your body, maybe it gets rid of like wrinkles or something. Silicone beauty blender. That means absolutely nothing to me. <laughs> <laughs> you could have said literally any of these pictures were silicone beauty blenders, and I probably would have believed it. So literally, you take it and you blend your makeup. So if you put foundation on, you put it on here, and it helps you blend your makeup into your face. Oh, I know people that need that. Something in my eye. 
Is that for like nails? What for nails? Does it like grind it down into the right shape you want it? Yeah, it's an electric nail file. Look at you. You're just. Ask me my eye. Blow it out. Three, two, one. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, you have a weak blow. Weak blow. All right, one more time. Three, two, one. <laughs> a weak blow. Don't ever, don't ever tell me I have a weak blow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lord. Okay, ready? Mm -hmm. Next one. What is this? Um, that's a shower cap. like it would like be a massager. Oh, does that have an answer? I don't know. I'm not <laughs> I'm not happy with it. It looks like it'd be like an iron boob. <laughs> How does it look gonna be like an iron boob? I don't know. <laughs> Do you even? Um I'm honestly stunned, I have no idea. It's a diffuser for a blow dryer. What does that even mean? You put it on the tip of your blow dryer and it helps like keep your curls from getting all messed up. Cause you know when you just blow it and it just sends your hair all over the place, it like diffuses the air so that it nicely keeps your hair curled and dry dry. Oh, okay. Not an iron boob, but so close. <laughs> what is this? No, I don't use this. So then how would I ever know? <laughs> it looks like it's like a body trimmer that like zaps your hair off. Zaps it off? Yeah, like it, like, it looks like it would glow and just and the hair just singed right off. Is there a final answer? Yeah. <laughs> it does remove hair, but it doesn't zap it off. It actually rips it out. Uh, so this machine goes and it like pulls out several hairs at once, like just rips it out. Okay. Yes, so it's an epilator. Epilator? Yes. What is it called? Fancy. How many more of these are there? Okay. I have had like 18 of them, so. Okay. Ready? Yes. What's this? Uh, that's knockoff AirPods. Why are final answer? <laughs> I don't know what that is. <laughs> Not knock on AirPods. I'm gonna tell you what it is. Sasha, what do you think they are? What do you think they are, buddy? <laughs> I wish you would find your chill. Okay. <laughs> this is an IUD. It helps you from getting pregnant. It's a form of birth control, so it goes right up in your patch. How does that work? They just like implant it up there, and then it like throws off your balance or something, I guess, and it keeps you from getting pregnant. Hmm. Nope. I don't have that. TMI. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what is oh, this? That's a life preserver. <laughs> They're usually bright orange, so you try to throw me off. That's that's another birth control thing, isn't it? Birth control thing? I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. I give up. <laughs> a pregnancy uh, pillow. Pregnancy pillow? <laughs> so not birth control? No. <laughs> now that I think about it, there's no, there's no real possible way that could be. Once you're using this, you don't need birth control anymore. <laughs> You're already too far gone. That's what do you mean by pregnancy pillow? Oh, because the large part's for your belly? Well, it's so you can lay on it and your belly will like stick right here and you can hold onto this part and it's like comfortable. Mm. It's really comfortable to sleep when you get pregnant. Nice. Yeah. Okay. I feel like I would love sleeping with one of those. All right, so what is this? Oh, this. <laughs> mm, 
that's like a mammogram machine? You saw it. What? Saw what? <laughs> what would I possibly have seen? <laughs> you like looked at it while I was looking at it. No, I'm, not, I'm very well aware of what mammograms are. <laughs> what is it? So how does the machine work? What does it do? I don't know exactly, but I'm assuming you walk up to it, assume the position that like scans your breast to see if you have tumors. You have to stick your boobs in it and it like presses them. Like, presses like them? A, like a pancake. Like a pancake? Yeah. Oh wow. <laughs> yep. They're good at what they do. Saving lives. Okay. What is this? We have one more after this one, then we're done. Okay. What is this? That's pimple cream. Is there a final answer? Wait. Uh, You're so sure about the pimple cream. <laughs> I think I've seen that on a proactive commercial. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna say that's another like anti-aging cream. That's my final answer. They're breast implants. No, that's what it it's is. The silicone breast implants. <laughs> oh wow. No kind of cream. <laughs> hey, they do a good job. What can I say? <laughs> okay, and then hold on. I have to do a quick. Babe, please hurry up. I'm ready to eat dinner. <laughs> What's this? Oh, I feel like I know what this is. <laughs> Never used one myself. <laughs> I think you use it on the red. This is a product for when you really want to treat yourself. I can tell. Fellas, big anniversary coming up. Get your lady one of these and don't ask questions. She will be satisfied. <laughs> Princess! Don't tell me this goes up your booty, please. What is this? <laughs> Judging by your reaction, I can't tell if it is or isn't. <laughs> um, Do you want me to tell you? I have, I have, <laughs> I'm not even gonna take a gander. It's a beauty blender again. Uh, I was thinking maybe it like went up, like it went on your eyes. It doesn't go on your eyes. It's for your foundation again. Oh, so it gives you that strawberry blonde look, but when you want it for your face. Well, no, the color of it doesn't cause your face to go pink. Oh. It's just, there are multiple different colors of them. You just dip your, you dip it in your foundation and then you put it on your face or use foundation. Mm. I never use them. Chris uses them. Gotcha. <laughs> or your booty. <laughs> just clip, well, that, clip that out. That is, no. <laughs> that is the last one. You actually did a pretty good job there at first. Thank you. Please, uh... Big brain season. Heck yeah. You know, I gotta flex the, the body's biggest muscle every now and then, you know what I'm saying? No, I'm just kidding. Guys, it please. It was only uh, for a little bit. Don't get cocky. It was for a little bit. Tell me in the comments how I did. Thank you for watching this video. And we'll be back with more videos, of course. Nah, probably not. I'm kind of done with YouTube. I'm serious. <laughs> what? <laughs> Here, let's let Dodger say goodbye. Thanks for preoccupying him, princess. Oh, <laughs> All right, say bye, Dodger. Easy bye. Easy bye. <laughs> Maybe I go behind the camera and he'll look at me. <gasps> bye, buddy. Say bye, Dodger. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> bye. He kind of looked. All right, see you guys. Talk to you later. Catch you in another video. Oh, make sure to like, share, subscribe. Comment down below, like Matt said. Tell them how he did. And tell your mothers that you love them.